Damn that's me, saffron sea While I'm wet up for slim and a sim basti A sim Pompeii while I light a long J Think I'm in Coachella where the crib in LA Staring at the stage, singing song and that's me Bump their head when they're sailing out seats And I make them bend, get my ass started With a pair like that, man I think I'm a dream hey, I'm a dreamer, now I'ma wake up in the state that I've been doing too much All the things on me to flourish, you ain't Good afternoon, lovely people. Today is the 7th of October. I'm here in my dressing room. It is quarter to three. It's Monday, it's quarter to three. I'm only dressed. I spent the morning in my night t shirt, lounging around, answering emails, doing all that kind of stuff. And I just felt a bit because yesterday I kind of had a chilled Sunday on the sofa and didn't actually get properly dressed so it happens yesterday I also had a bit of a bad day with my food or maybe a good day because I had pizza and I had garlic bread and I had ice cream and it was yummy and now today my weight is up but that is okay because for the past three weeks I've been dieting if you can follow me on Instagram, I've been doing a diet and it's like a mini, well it's not really mini because I'm planning on doing it to, for seven to eight weeks and I've been quite successful so far. I started out at 125 pounds, last week I was averaging around 119 pounds, today I'm 123 but four pounds completely normal after you've ate a load of pizza and garlic bread and ice cream and done all that kind of jazz. So don't be hard on yourself. This is your motivation right here. You've had a bad day yesterday. It's yesterday. It's done. You can't do anything about it now. You can sit and you can feel sorry for yourself and you can scold yourself or you can just go, yes, that pizza and whatever else you ate was delicious and you enjoyed it. And now we just get back to it because the worst thing you can do right now is just throw the towel in and go, well, I've eaten all that now. I've ruined my diet. What's the point? I'm crap. I can't do this. Stop. Stop with all the self-deprecation. Stop feeling sorry for yourself. If you want to lose weight, if that is your goal, just get back to it. Everyone has a day where they just want to give in and especially when you're on a weight loss journey. Of course there's people out there who just want to maintain their weight and people who are trying to gain weight but I'm focusing on those people right now who are trying to drop some body fat because they don't feel healthy, they feel overweight, and they have a goal of getting healthier. Even though your goal might be to get healthier, you also have to have a healthy mindset. It's not all about your body. You should be concentrating on having a positive attitude towards food and your intake, and part of life is enjoying food. And if you have the luxury of eating out, or if you have the luxury of you know, ordering a takeaway, do that occasionally, but just get back to it because the way you gain weight is through going down a negative spiral of punishing yourself with food and that's what we're not what we're going to do we're going to reward ourselves with healthy food and then the occasional treat which was yesterday for me it wasn't planned and we're going to get back to it so today um, as it's Monday, I am starting off my training again. I like to start fresh every week on a Monday. Yeah, last week I did my 70,000 steps, just about. Just about got them done. I did three cardio sessions that varied from 150 to 200 calories. I Most days I walk the dogs twice today. I haven't walked them yet, so I'll walk them later. And then... Um, I also trained four times. Two of those sessions were at home, two of them were in the gym, and over the coming weeks, I'm gonna share with you some simple at-home training because I have invested in a little bit of equipment for at home. It is very inexpensive. It's just some resistance bands, things like that, that you can pick up on Amazon or you know your local fitness store. But I invested in them very minor investment and they've been great 
they've actually been a lifesaver because some days and I know there's a lot of people out there that um, maybe newbies to the gym and just don't feel comfortable going to the gym so um, the gym can be quite an intimidating place for a lot of people whether you're male female it can just be intimidating because it's full of loads of other fit people and you feel like people are looking at you so at home workouts can be a great way to get started or if you're feeling a bit anxious or something at that time so I'm going to share with you some of my at home workouts over the coming weeks today I'm going to do a very simple at home workout that you can just start off with so today guys I am wearing the new move color in the Marl Red from Women's Best. So the leggings are high-waisted. I tend to th turn them down a little bit. They're completely squat-proof. They're a good length, so go down to here on me, I'm five foot one. So they're not super long, but you have to turn them up loads. I tend to turn them up maybe once sometimes, depending on how I want to look. Um, it has the little women's best symbol here. There's no contouring in the Move collection. They're just like a simple cut legging. Really comfy, elasticated. You can see the top again, really simple with an open back feature here. And we can see that it has the little women's best symbol here. It's got some extra padding in here and good support considering I've got big fake boobies. So just a really nice, simple set. And it comes the long sleeve. I'm not gonna wear this today. This is the long sleeve. It has the open thumb holes. And again, just really simple and comfortable. And this is the Marl Red. It's also going to launch in this beautiful purpley lilac color, which is kind of like a Marl purple. And again, it comes in the leggings, the bra top and the long sleeve. And then we also have a kind of a baby blue color launching as well, but I don't have that to show you guys. It is launching on Monday the 14th of October. So go check it out. You can use Lamy 10 for 10% off. And I've got a link down below in the description box. If you fancy buying it. Now back to my day. So before I do anything, I'm gonna have some breakfast. I know it's very late, um, but oh, honestly, after all the pizza last night, I wasn't really hungry this morning. So I've just been having coffee, and now I'm having some oats. So no, I'm not gonna cook back on my macros today or anything like that. I'm just gonna get back to what I was eating last week. So I've got some protein porridge. We are today using the Fitway salted caramel, which is really nice in oats. And I'm probably gonna put some chocolate chips maybe on top. I'm gonna have that, then I'm gonna train and get on with the day. Don't let it hold you back. So today I'm gonna to take you through four different exercises. It shouldn't take you more than 15, 20 minutes to do this. I would recommend doing four sets. Some of these exercises are coming in supersets. A superset is when you team two exercises back to back and do them consecutively. Then you take a break after doing them consecutively. Your break can range from anything from 30 seconds to one minute, depending on how out of breath you are. This is not a HIIT workout. It is a weight resistance exercise. With high intensity interval training, the difference is that you are trying to get your heart rate up and then drop it down with the rest periods, which are limited. Whereas in this, we are doing resistance training. So it's completely different. So take your rest in between each set, not for too long. You want to keep the momentum going. So don't get lazy. We want to get this done in as little time as possible because this at home workout is for people with limited time. We have our equipment, so we are ready to go. Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Yeah.
I'm Superman, I spend my time flying high, going round, but I'm always getting wayside. Some people trying to shit on me, I said, girl, you can sit on me, cause bitch, they be hating on me. Bitch, they be hating on me.